morning and welcome. I'm Zinder and this is episode 27. I had to think about that. My Minecraft Let's Play. And uh, basically, th there's going to be a little change out here once I go out the door. But um, what happened was I originally tried to record this episode and it didn't record properly. What I mean by that is I had muted my mic for recording some shit um, on APB. And I forgot to turn the microphone back on for the recording, so what ended up happening was there was no commentary. It was basically a silent episode. But uh, I'm sure you might see it in the distance over there. That is basically, the plan is to make a railway the whole way over to the abandoned mine shaft. And the cobblestone base is prepared. Um... But what I need is I still need to make rails and whatnot. But I was sitting here in my chair watching some Minecraft videos because that's what I do. And it came to mind, I've got all that cobble and I want to do something with it. And I kind of want to just f fucking flatten this mountain. I just want to destroy it, make it go away. Now, I know I'm going to end up with a lot more materials in the process of doing that, but, uh, oh, I'm sure you'll see my swords glowing. I had 11 experience, and I said, you know what, I'm going to use it and enchant my sword. I got sharpness 1, fire aspect 1, and knockback 1. It's a pretty sexy sword. It actually, uh, if I do it right, I can two-shot creepers, or pretty much anything. So it saves me durability literally takes half the durability to kill something. But, uh... And the reason why I have some pork is I actually tried killing a pig to see if I could light it on fire and let it die from the fire. But the sharpness actually caused me to one-shot the pig. Because... Well... Uh, you know what? When I originally started this out, I said this isn't going to be a tutorial. It's going to be more for veteran players. But... I think I'm going to start adding little pieces of information, partly because I know that one of the people that watches this doesn't know much about the game, and uh, a lot of the stuff he's actually learned has been from watching me. So, back on topic, the reason why I was testing to see if I could kill a pig with the fire is because if you kill an animal, such as a chicken, or a pig, or a cow, oh fuck, oh thanks Scraper, and it uh, dies from the fire... What happens is it uh, it actually roasts the meat. So I don't need to spend coal cooking it and time and whatnot. Which, speaking of which, I have stuff that I went and retrieved from the mine shaft that I need to get smelting. And I best do that if I'm going to sit here and chop this out. First, I'm going to deal with these guys. Watch this. The knockback's pretty good. Sit, let them burn. Oh, I think I failed to hit them. Let me try that again. I saw a creeper. Good tangle. Ooh, that's a skeleton. That is not a creeper. Why am I eating zombie meat? Because I have it. That's actually really handy. I hit them, it knocks them back. And then... Wow, that was crazy. And then uh, it keeps them away from me. Gives me some time to think when they sneak up on me like that. Hey, Creeper. Come over here. What? Okay, don't come over here. Apparently this guy wants a piece of me. Oh, Creeper behind me! Yeah. And, uh... Now, this is how... This is basically the reason why... Jesus Christ. After I, uh, enchanted my... Sword, I ended up getting experience pretty quickly. But that was... It was uh, th there was less action in the failed episode than you've seen so far in this one. So, don't feel like you missed anything. Because trust me, you didn't. I actually was going to feel ashamed to upload it originally. Because it was so bad. And then... The whole th shenanigans with the no microphone happened and... I was actually rather happy. Because it didn't even need to be something that was on camera. Pretty much the entire episode was me building through the air with cobblestone. 
I'm sure you can see why I consider that very boring, and I'm sure somebody else might consider that very boring. I didn't fall, and basically nothing happened. It was an episode filled with nothing. It, like, I, I don't even know how to describe how boring the nothing was. So, I'm just going to stop now and just say it was boring. Um. Oh, come on. Just leave me alone. Okay. I always forget that zombies have a little bit more health than normal mobs. Oh, it hit me. I don't know why, but every single time I try to critically hit somebody, it just doesn't work. I can't. Hey, string. Yeah, fly away, creeper. Get more gunpowder. Do some more TNT mining. I've already got enough for two TNT. Oh! That's cool. This... This isn't... My original, or my original, my plan is to not have this just be a one block thing through it. It's going to be like a full on tunnel. But, uh, as it currently stands, it appears to be a very, very good source of mobs. It's kind of like an accidental EXP farm. As you can see, I've placed some of the powered rail, but I need to make more because I wasn't able to make it the whole way there. But, uh, apparently. I think I just lost a piece of gunpowder. What happened to that spider? There was a spider up here. Hmm. But, hmm. Maybe I'll just go find somewhere more flat. Ooh, Enderman. If we're gonna fight the Enderman, we're gonna make sure my health is full and stays there. Well, not stays there, but it regenerates. My f hunger bar is full. That's what I'm going for. Oh, <laughs> he didn't like that. You enjoying your burning? Well, no, uh, under pearl, but and, and I kind of want to revisit that, but I. My original plan is I'm thinking I'm just going to make a minecart station up here in the hill. Which, I think instead of what I'm doing, I might just do that. Like, I'm just going to hollow this all out and just make a big minecart station. My original plan was I wanted to make a giant area. Like, a huge area. And just surround it with cobblestone walls and light it all up and everything. But... That's a lot of work that I don't want to do on camera, so boohoo on that. And in case you're wondering, because I know you guys know that I got, you know, diamonds and whatnot while I was on my ex my excavation. Wow, well, my uh, exploration shenanigans. Um, I actually have four more diamonds, and as long as I don't really use up my pick, those will probably all become be used in swords, which I will eventually enchant one with a high level enchant. And I'm actually thinking about just making an iron pick and enchanting it to see if I can get, like, fortune or looting. So if I can get looting, I can just two-hit mobs and then switch to it real quick and hit them and whatever. But they need is an enchant that increases the experience gain. Whoa. Hold the light. I, I don't even know. I, I, I don't even know what you'd call it. Now that I try and think about it. But, I I'm mostly just digging and randomly talking here with no actual idea of what I'm doing. Um, like, I have an idea, and I keep on breaking that torch. But, I don't have a complete idea. And I was originally going to make it all come up through here and whatnot and be a nice little cool path, but it's just so in the way. Why not just dig through the mountain? Just go right through there go to a whole new area, whatever. I mean, I got this right here that partly exists, so why not just run this down here? Oh. And if you can't tell, I'm doing a lot better job of continuous talk today, but it's because I actually have quite a few ideas I wanted to do. 
and I wanted to enlighten you guys on what those ideas were. Another idea I should have is to go put the iron and gold into a furnace. Because I should do that. And I said about it before, but for some reason I haven't done it. I kind of want to do something with water too, just because of... Ooh. Well, I'm going to go make uh, more shovels and put the stuff in there. It's going to be uneventful. I could just cut it, but meh. I don't really see any real point in cutting it. And I got those slime balls, so I was thinking about making a piston door. But I keep on trying to think about a way where it's not going to let mobs in. Even though with this sword, it, it doesn't really matter. I, I see no reason to really be too afraid of mobs. And I'm sure somebody's going to laugh at me and be like, Yeah, you're saying that now. Yes. Yes, I am saying that now. But, uh... Ooh, that's not where you go. I didn't even stash some of the stuff that I had. Like, the redstone. So I've got a decent amount of that now. But four diamonds. Isn't that cool? Oh, I got those melon seeds. I should really make a melon farm. I should do a lot of things. I've got a lot of things that I need to do. And I'm not doing a very good job of doing them. The only thing I've managed to do a very good job of so far that this episode is actually pay attention to how long the episode is going on. Which... Okay, I just need two... Well, uh, not two melons. I need 18 melon slices. Essentially. You know, I'm going to put this in the fourth this fourth one here, and I'm going to completely forget. But, shovels. Um, I think I'm just going to... Uh, I'm going to do something eventful for the episode, I think. And then I'm going to just work on the minecart station. Like, I'm not going to actually do the, the building without everybody here. Yes. You're here. Whether you believe it or not, you're here. In this area. Just spectating, of course, but you're here. And, uh, I'll do, I'll clear it out. And play around with the redstone and the pistons and stuff, which I haven't been wanting. I've been trying to avoid branch mining, especially with my cobble blocks filling up. But I think I'm going to turn that all into stone bricks, to be honest. Yeah, that's going to take a lot of coal. I should make try and make a looting iron pick. I need to kill things for that. Maybe I should go down and tangle with the spiders. I, I kind of... A lot of the things that I said I didn't want to do, it's actually getting to the point where not doing them is making life difficult. Like, it's not making things harder. It's just making them difficult. So, what am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing. I, I don't think I ever really finished screwing around with the boat thing down there. But I'm just going to forget about that for now. This, this, right here... This is getting on my nerves. Because getting back in is such a pain. I swear, I'm going to put a workbench somewhere more accessible. Because having to walk the whole way over here to use workbenches is completely wasting your guys' time. It's wasting my time. Everybody's just plain old, plain old losing out on this whole thing. So, that's not fun. And apparently, I don't even know what I'm doing. Um, I thought my black nether bricks combined with the redstone was a spider. We don't need you there. But, uh... I was going to say something. Hmm. Um, yeah. I'm just going to say melon farm. Why am I going to say Melon Farm? He got me on that one. I got a bucket of water. Uh, I don't have any dirt. 
I should get some dirt. Dirt. Uh, four dirt. Hmm. Might as well make some uh, bone meal while I'm at it. I, I, you know, I haven't decided where I'm gonna put this either. I don't want to put it there. Ooh, cactus. I haven't been down here in a while. I don't really care too much. You know, I should harvest these reeds. I'm sure they're plenty grown by now. Oh my god. How did I just harvest that one reed on the other side of a reed without harvesting the reed itself? Hmm, what did I get? Oh, wow. 64. That's, uh... Hmm. That's... I should know this. Yeah, yeah I do know this. That's, uh, seven bookcases, I think. What am I doing? I'm just running around like an idiot now. Not actually doing anything. Hmm. This episode went from decent to... What the hell am I doing? Not a very good episode. Well, I guess I'll come down here and check for slimes. Partly because slimes are some of the best experience. Unless it was changed. I haven't noticed the larger slimes dropping experience when I destroy them, but it does break into a ton of small slimes, so I guess I guess it is normal. I'm just out of my mind. What what where did you come from? That's right, just burn to death. Nobody likes you. I thought I heard another zombie, but I guess I'm just out of my mind. I come over here, and... I don't hear any slimes. Heard me walking on gravel. hear anything. So while I was sitting there standing still, I wasn't just like randomly AFKing on you guys. Kinda surprised I don't I haven't found any slimes. Kinda depressing too. There's my mess of cobblestone. Alright. Zombie spawner. Um Could easily make an experience farm out of this. Kind of want to do that. Why? Because apparently everything I said I didn't want to do, I'm now lying. I'm going to do everything that I said I didn't want to do. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna play Minecraft. I'm gonna play things normally. Do things right. However, except for armor, I might sometime. Well. Come 1.2, the changes and stuff where I won't be able to screw with the mob AI because it's going to be slightly more intelligent, it, it might actually make armor a little bit more necessary. Um, and if I get really bored, I'll set the game to hard. It's just not normal at the moment, but with the upcoming thing of zombies being able to break down wooden doors in hard mode and um, hardcore, th that'll be actually kind of interesting even though my doors don't even look wooden anymore they look like aluminum glass pane doors but that is beside the point what am I doing? Where, I, I've never seen mushrooms spawn inside of a well spawner I don't know how big this room is either I'm just cutting out the walls partly so I have easier access to the uh, well it's a lot larger area for one. I'm going to need to figure out what's, what the lengths and stuff are, and I'm going to have to set it all up so it's a proper experience farm, and I'll probably make, like, a ladder to the surface or something, And but I find this to be of no concern. One thing I do find to be of concern, though, is on multiplayer, 
I'm kind of surprised it hasn't been fixed yet, where the only place you can hit a mob is pretty much in the chest area and the head. You can't actually hit them in the, uh, the body, or like the legs, the lower body. It, it, you just can't. It doesn't let you. It's not an applicable target. Um, but, you know, I'm going to have to rip this whole bottom part out, so I might as well. Or I will run out of pick. You know what? Let's take the saddle. Whatever. Take the chest, too. Ah! That was not what I was expecting. How did you spawn? Well, I suppose. I made the room bigger, so the sides are darker, but... That startled me. I was not expecting that. Um, hmm. I didn't bring any... Well, I didn't bring enough stuff for ladders. I hope I'm going the right way. I'm gonna have to get stuff like all that coal. It's a, quite a bit of coal just sitting there. All this lava will be nice for something. I'll come up with a reason for it eventually. I did have an idea related to self-building walls. Yeah. But I actually just didn't do it. You know, I brought dirt. I brought water. I don't have a pick. I knew this. That's why I was going back in the first place. You know, this takes so long to go up, I might as well just dig another hole next to it and place, like, a three-block deep thing of water and just jump in it every time. And... Hmm. I thought I had a lot more planned for this episode, but once I actually got into trying to do it, everything I had planned just kind of disappeared out of my mind, apparently. So, I might actually just call this. I know it's early, I know it's not the usual 30-minute episodes I make, but it's 20, so, I mean, it's fine. I'm not really going to do a whole lot. I'm not going to actually craft any of the, you know, I'm not going to, like, work on the, uh, the experience term, like, I'm not actually gonna make it, I might dig it out and stuff, or probably, probably say screw it and branch mine and keep all the diamonds and not make armor with it. I'll probably work on the experience bench. Experience bench, wow. Enchanting table! Wow. Just, just wow. Um, but I do have quite a bit of stuff that I wanted to do. And most of it's kind of boring stuff that's not really worth recording. At least, in my opinion. Um, here I am, screwing around with all the random stuff in my inventory, trying to organize it. Completely forgetting to even check these things. Iron. Iron. Ooh, gold. Nothing? Okay. Um, I should make railway tracks. At least get the rail over to there set up. However, I'm going to just run back and forth like an idiot a bunch. Yeah. No? Maybe. Okay, I'm just going to do things the simpler way. Oops. How many rails is this going to get me? I don't know, you do the math. 16 times 16. And there we go. Leftover sticks. Let's make some torches. I'm going to obviously place all this rail probably off camera. As with a bunch of other random things I have planned. Um, none of it's really worth recording. I think I might actually use the hell out of the tree farm. So that'll be interesting enough, I suppose. 
not really interesting, but I really do want to make this goddamn melon farm. You know, I added iron to my inventory for making picks, and I didn't. I'm pretty pro, apparently. You know what? Hell with it. I'll add three more. Why? Look at my, uh, look at my axe. And because of the fact that when I do this, I would normally end up with more sticks than I was going to use. So, this takes care of that. I don't know why I still have this saddle on me. That's probably more than enough rail, which is actually kind of surprising. But I'm going to get this stupid meliform? Wow. Melon farm growing. And, uh, I was trying to play around with Sony Vegas to actually do some editing, but I ran into a problem. There was... Uh, none of the formats that it would let me compress into matched up with my requirements for size and quality. These episodes that I have right here that I upload, most of these episodes are actually, uh... Less than a gig, despite being in 1080p. And in order to get close to the same size, the quality goes to hell. In order to get close to the same quality, the size is just insane. I need more dirt. There should be dirt down here. Um, so, I kind of gave up on that for the time being. If anybody knows anything about Sony Vegas in a way that they can actually provide me with tips with that. But, like, as it currently stands, I'm not really using any kind of full thing of it. Just because I, I wasn't... I always have this thing where I like to try before I buy. And especially whenever it's something that's going to cost me, like, 50 bucks. I mean, games, sometimes I have expectations and, you know, I... Um, let me try that sentence again. And th there'll be games that I'm waiting for, and I'll get them, or I'll see a game, and I'll be like, that looks cool, and I would get it. But something like Sony Vegas, th I'm not going to get it if there's a chance that I'll never actually use it. I mean, maybe one day I'll actually get into video production and whatnot, but I have no training in any of that. It, it would basically be me learning things and just doing things from my mind, and this and that. You know, I came down here to see if I could find any slime. But, there was no slime. Tell you what I'll do. I'll look at the clock, and be like, this is about 30 minutes. But for the next episode, I'm going to make an iron pick. I think I'm going to try and get my enchanting level to 15, and make an iron pick. And enchant it. Why? Because I want to see if I can get fortune. Yeah, it's an iron pig. It wouldn't last very long. But yeah, it was. It would be, you know, enchanting level of 15. I mean, I'm already at 8. I haven't even really done anything. If I make the experience farm and do that, I suppose it'd be a lot easier. I am going to need to build a ladder system up to that. I'll, I'll probably do that, get everything all set up, get all kinds of stuff going, put chests there, fill it with stone swords or something. Gotta make use of the stone somehow, and they're... getting them within actual punching level by kill... well, not killing, but dropping them with a mob evader is an inaccurate process. Like... I'd actually have to try kinda hard. And... I don't really... It's not that I don't really feel like trying that hard, it's just the amount of effort required in to get the reward probably probably isn't really worth it. So, uh, but I'm gonna go... Oh, it's night time. I'm gonna go smack some zombies, because I heard one. Ooh, an Enderman. What the hell with the zombies? I wanna kill the Enderman. Mm. 
No Ender Pearl. Part of the reason why I'm looking for the uh, like killing Endermen so regularly is I want to get Ender Pearls and make Eyes of Ender, and I want to go find a stronghold. Cause I kind of want to go to the end. Why do I want to go to the end? I have no idea. I, I kind of feel like going to the end would be like the end of the map, and it's the last thing I should ever do. Partly because of the fact that the Ender Dragon drops a gratuitous amount of experience. But... Yeah. Oh. You trying to knock me down there with the creeper, you stupid skeleton? Skeleton. Spiders are now skeletons! Okay. Um... Yeah. That's not something you want to see every day. Jump down, turn around, and find a creeper in your face. Speaking of creepers in my face, I. Oh, oh that was him taking damage. I thought I heard another one behind me. I was like, oh god. Uh, you know what? Nine. Whatever. This will probably be the last thing I enchant before I make the, the the farm. So let's find a nine and efficiency. Lame. Oh well. Um, I'm gonna call this good, and I'll see you guys again in episode twenty-eight.